BSSO. This stands for Bilateral Sagittal Split Osteotomy. It's the procedure used to lengthen an underdeveloped mandible, or jaw. For a BSSO of the mandible, the teeth are first prepared with braces. The teeth are aligned in anticipation of where the jaw will be after surgery, as opposed to where it is now. Once aligned, the patient can be brought in for surgery. After the patient has been anesthetized, the mouth is opened, and a surgeon makes an incision inside the mouth, below the teeth, to expose the jaw. The surgeon will then make a cut through the hard exterior of the bone, and delicately work their way through the interior bone and marrow, taking particular care to preserve the inferior alveolar nerve, which allows sensation in the chin and lower teeth. Once the bone is fully separated on both sides, it can be moved forward to a more fitting position. Plates and screws are then put in place to allow for natural bone regrowth between the pieces. The corrected jaw will align upper and lower teeth, as planned out in advance with your orthodontist. Now, this procedure alone may be enough to restore the face's form, or depending on the patient's individual needs, there may also be a second procedure, the osseous genioplasty. The chin is then defined by moving this piece of bone forward. As with the BSSO, special care must be taken to avoid damaging nerve fibers. There is, however, a risk with each procedure of such damage. Once again, a plate and screws will hold the new alignment in place. And six to 12 months later, when the teeth have finished settling into their new position, the braces can be removed. Thus, facial function and form is restored.